What is going on everybody? How you guys doing? My name is JX Kicks and I want to welcome you guys back to another video on the channel. Today we're going to do an early review on some Jordans and before that though, I do guys want to show you, I want to show y'all a pickup that I picked up for a shirt. And I usually don't do these because it's a shirt, but I thought this was nice so to show it off. But this is a Stone Cold shirt that I got. Shout out to my boy Atlas Vintage for selling me this. A quick. Bam. But yeah, something a little small, feel me? Pick this up because this is gonna match the sneakers that I'm about to review for you guys. And I got them early. So yeah. Um, these are the Jordan 8 playoffs, the retros, based off the original cut when they came out back in 19. I forgot the year, but that's besides the point. So I got these because my friend, well, my guy that's home with the shirt, got these early. And he was just selling them. He told me he didn't want them, so he gave me them for the price that he paid. Um, but yeah, man. Yeah. Just to show you real quick, I know a lot of people think that when people do early reviews, the sneakers are fake. These are not fake. These are authentic. Um, but I was so excited to get these because I wanted these for a long time. Even when they retroed, um, I wanted the cut. The cut wasn't correct on that shoe, but I wanted them nonetheless because of the colorway. And now that I got the correct cut with the, cor the correct colorway, it makes everything even better. But to start off with these Jordan 8s, you got a regular Jordan 8 midsole without so. And the colors. Midsole's all black. Not too much sparkle on this pair. Show you real quick. It's a new book upper with some leather on it. I can see twenty-three. Then the Jordan Eight Puff Jordan logo, whatever you want to call it. Here. Not gonna lie, these materials are not the best. They're going to retail for $210, but um, yeah, I just wanted to give you guys an early review on these. This is nothing too crazy, but I was excited for these personally, and they also matched the shirt, so, and the inside, I'm, I love the inside of this. There. I can zoom out a little bit, I can, there you go. Bam, it's a little bit better. Y'all can see the background, but. Bam. This is the other side. One thing I do like about these, like I said, is it got that old school cut from back in the 90s. It's more higher than a regular Jordan 8 Retro we see in the 2000s, the 2010s. It's got like that 90s cut like it, when it first came out. Um, the tabs, they're matte black or matte gray, whatever you want to call it, matte black. And I pff, couldn't wait for this release because of the black and red uh, color scheme. And then the bottom had its crazier colors with the blue and the yellow. The red back pull tab. Bam. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section below on these. Um, Jordan 8 retro playoffs. Bam. Yep, so thank you guys for watching. I appreciate y'all. I'll catch y'all later.